That's not a jump. I would know a jump. There's some more jumps on the other side, big jumps. So far, no one's yelled at us. Mostly just people saying, what's up? Cool bikes, are those electric? Whoa, let's not die yet. Ooh, shortcut. I'm gonna take the shortcut. No, I'm not. Ronsters up there with street tires. Fifty track. Oh, no, I just changed my shirt. <laughs> I've been here the whole time. I was like, we got another one. Yes. Yeah, I just got a little too hot. I got you, clipping it. This is good shit. <laughs> that guy's on an OG Q-Berg. And then there's a, there's the newer Q-Berg here too. The one with the uh, telescoping seat 
and the smaller rear wheel in the back. You can turn it to an off-road scooter, to a dirt bike, to whatever you need it to be. We'll look at that better later. Parker's just passing people on a Super 73. All together. Chain down. I hear gas bikes. They're gonna come bully us. Oh yeah. Not enough speed. It chains off again. This uh, thing in front of us here is the, it's the new Q-Berg. First time I've seen one in real life. The, the rear tire is smaller than the front one. And it has a telescopic seat that you can raise and lower. And I guess its top speed is uh, 55. Very interesting. Very interesting bike. This, see, this would be a bit of a task with street tires. Oh, whoa, oh, chain down. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure you can, obviously you can do it, but it might take a little more skill than... Why is there a jacuzzi here? Who dumps their jacuzzi right there? Oh, he's right behind me. <laughs> Street it, Street tires. Whoa. Go up that thing. You can go up that? Oh my god. <laughs> That was incredible.
sidekick for this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it. Calling it. Oh no! Yeah, I don't even care. Oh, you're gonna want to go back to lane two. Because there's a steep ass uphill that we'll have to go up. But does your your motor get you through though? Yeah, but this thing. So when it's if it spins up, like if you're pushing it. Uh, it's got like a fail safe to stop like damage, so it'll cut power when it starts to think it's spinning in, in dirt. Oh, okay. So the it's like, lock. yeah, it's, without being able to pedal and assist and keep the wheel like constant, it's this is killing me. All right. Good shit. It was good meeting you, man. Good ride with you guys. Sorry. Yeah. Next time, next week, next month, whatever we do this again, I'm gonna have this thing new derailleur. I'm just gonna buy a derailleur. <laughs> Aftermarket. Okay. <laughs> Damn, bro. Thanks for coming out. Appreciate you guys. Enjoy the rest of the ride. Nice to meet you. Bro, good meeting you. We'll see you soon, man. We'll see you soon. Next month. Yeah. We'll be back harder. Yeah. Alright. Everybody else? Good? Chain good? Radical. I guess supers can't hang. <laughs> they're not really they're not really meant for this. Although that's their off-road bike, which is really funny. Yeah. They're good. They're good for what they are, but they really shouldn't be on this kind of stuff. Scrape my peg on some something. I say something. It's obviously a rock. I'm into this kind of stuff. Ooh, just really don't want to bash my foot on a rock. Ooh. Let's get a little little regen going here even though that does basically nothing Dude, street tires, man. I would not want to do this with slicks on. Your wheelie skills are not going to help you in the wilderness, Sir Onster. Oh, I heard a horn. Oh. 
I heard a horn in the rear. Okay, Saronster's over there. Mark is still way, way back there. An absurdly far, <laughs> absurdly far back. Oh, it's good. I just heard a horn. I just heard somebody honking, so I uh, I stopped. But I think that's everybody. Yeah, that's good. I always go up this. I've never been down this one. This one's fun. There he is, street machine. <laughs> the slick. Yeah, some of that stuff I was like, wow, I would not. And only a back break. You're killing it. You're you're. It's so great, man. Yeah. Just like <laughs> we gotta regroup every like two minutes or else we fall behind. Well, look where Mark is. Mark was behind me. I thought I was the last one. I was stressing out. Bro, right, I'm literally I'm skidding the whole way. <laughs> I got my rear wheel just locked. Yeah. Your uh, your wheelies aren't gonna save you out here. No, I'm out of my element right now, but I'm really enjoying this off-roading. I'm gonna get Cooper here. I think that looked good. And I want to ask him more. Make sure to follow Sir Ronster. He makes amazing content, but he doesn't make the same money I do because he has um, puts trademark music. Three. Pushing me, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> Out of my element. I knew you could do it. I can't believe you guys ripped at that so quick. That's yeah, so dude, cool. I, looked out there. What the I was just taking my time. I was like, this is gnarly, man. This is scary. <laughs> oh, you want to show us where those big daddy jumps are? Uh, yeah, yeah. Overdrive. This is the hill. You want to go up? No, overdrive. Overdrive. <laughs> Squeaky brakes. terrifying Kubergs make a positive chime noise. Oh no. They make a positive chime noise. Like you just got a notification on Tinder every time you switch modes or turn it on or something. Oh, this is not going to be easy. Man. Damn. Sorry, guys. I think I went to fucking 
Ah, and then a thorn caught me. Good luck getting up that with street tires. That was not... That was not a normal obstacle. There's no way that a Super 73 could do all this. Good thing Parker bailed when he did. Because this would, this would just destroy one of those even with a V3. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. 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 I wasn't ready for that. I was just like, oh shit. That's what's cool about new tracks. You never know what's coming. It's like, oh shit. Yeah. Peg it. Uh oh. Oh no. Hold on. He's coming this way. Sorry. Okay, guys. I took it down to 60, just that little hill. <laughs> that was nice of those gas bikes to uh, not throw tomatoes or eggs at us. Call us pussies. But pew, pew, they stunk up this trail. forward to uh, going down this oh wow that's everyone I'll follow your your route. All right. No feet on the ground. All right, just that one spot. It's a bit rough. I asked Saronster if he was coming to this event, and he said, and then he sent me a a picture. He was like, "This event," and he was on the flyer. Stupid question, I guess.
Ooh, my feet touched. I adjusted my uh, suspension a tad, so it's a little softer and it springs back a little quicker. Utilizing more, more travel. This is, this, uh, this is like my favorite kind of riding where the trails are a little wider and yeah. they're a little flatter. Right. You just, you just tear it up. I'll you on that massive jump right there. Massive. You got some air, bro. Dude, do a wheelie in the dirt where you won't get demonetized. Yeah, no, <laughs> jump over there, I'm sick. Oh, oh. Well this is the one on the left is way sendable. The one on the right is a nice like warm up. Oh, I want to hit that big. Oh, there's side by sides out here. Here's Mark going for a 60% send. And <laughs> nice. Oh, now no one's going to watch me full send. Well, no one saw it except for you guys. Oh, that's a Parker jump right there. There are some legit obstacles here. Ooh, I like this. Ooh, scraped my toe on the ground. See, this is not even a... Like what, you're supposed to hit that like a jump? Land there? That's a, that's a flat. 
That is a flat. There we go. Off-road wheelies. Perfectly acceptable. Perfectly acceptable for YouTube's al algorithm. Yeah. Woo! You see my goggles? Yeah. My goggles flipped onto my head. <laughs> they were like this and then I landed and they went like that. Dude, I got the, oh my ah, hurt my foot though. Did I get it? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Ow, I fucking hurt my foot bad. Nice little, nice little easy Those little jumps jump. over there are sick. Yeah, this is where I learned how to jump first. It took like one a week was... to get, get brave enough. And that's then... probably oh, the biggest one I've done. Right there. I, I just jumped down today for the first time, Scary. so you guys gave me courage. <laughs> yeah, I see one else doing it, I'm like, uh, well. Oh, wow. Dude, definition of bottoming out. I'm going to take the street back. Can I ride it? Oh, shit. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you good with a lot of power? Yeah. Yeah, you might yeah go for it. I live like right around here. Is there anything special to that? No, brakes on the rear brakes on the left. Pretty much the same. Over that, yeah, clip and go. Are you good with a lot of power? Are you are you good with a lot of power? That was offensive to me. I just crash it. This sounds way more like a bee than my my light bee. Whoa! Oh, that was insane. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. This thing is smaller and lighter than a Suron. And it zips like no one's business. Well, I mean, Kuberg business. I just hit a massive jump. Not massive, but I mean... It's not like going from a Suron to this is that... much different. Uh, I'm triggered. I'm triggered right now. But I'm on a pretty fun little bike. This thing is so light. Whoa! Got the front wheel up there a little bit. Totally different feel than that. Yeah, dude, this thing is loud. I like how loud it is. It whistles, huh? Yeah. Is there a kickstand? No. Oh, no kickstand? No, no kickstand. Yeah, this thing's a trip. Dude, that thing is crazy. It's definitely more dirt bike feeling. That's good Oh, it's like, it's like bare bones. It's this like, one, yeah. it's gotta be, it's lighter than this, I'm assuming, yeah. right? Do you know the weight? Uh, 80, 80 pounds. And what, what model is that? The Freerider. <laughs> yeah, the Kuberg Freerider. Kuberg Freerider. Yeah. Very cool, man. Yeah, I've done a lot to it. You know, controllers upgraded, batteries upgraded. Oh, so it's not stock. stock. And the shock is clearly new. Yeah. But wow. It's fun. Oh my god. It's like a Pew. Let's 
I wish my horn was just exhaust noise. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yikes! Woo! I might go laugh. It's like a laugh. Kind of just have to chill going down. It's a little steep. Yeah. Eric has his baton. You got your baton out here in the wilderness? <laughs> in case you see a cougar? Exactly. Is that what that is? Okay. Yeah. Yikes! This is when you need them little brush guards for your levers. Like a glove. Yikes. Truck gets stuck and it just lives out here now for, li for life. What, this little hole? Is this the right hole? Oh my god. People aren't going to realize to go this way. And make sure they know to go left. Yeah. Wow, look at this little hobbit trail. This is wild. I saw it. I was like off the bike. What an incredible little trail. This must have taken so long to to build.
a lot of forks and such. Oh, he's got a supermoto in the back. Tire check. Skateboarders, that's something you definitely don't bring. That is not the appropriate vehicle for this terrain. Here's what you bring out here. You bring your Suron, you bring your Q-Brig, you bring your mountain bike, and you br or you bring your Super 73 for about, there's about 15% of the terrain here you can ride on a Super 73. Here's what you don't bring out here. Uh, refrigerator, office chair, skateboard. Just a little tip for people who are potentially thinking about coming out here. Here we go. I'm back in my happy time. Yep, yep, yeah, let's get it. Woo! Dusty wheelies. The fuck? that guy go just having a blast <laughs> yeah, boy. Well, I guess that's the video, guys. It was a fun little day with the Kubrig team.
nice to ride a little Kubrick free rider or whatever it's called this is just um, a minefield of of punctures right here uh yeah good little squad Saroncer did fine with his street wheels Parker left prematurely because he brought a super 73 what is this This could be jumped, but we're not gonna jump it because we don't want to get hurt now at the end of the day. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you're not already a member of the e-bike nation. If you want to support me in other ways, you can check out my Teespring link, get yourself some loophole culture merch. Remember to ride safe, guys. Remember to be positive. Remember to take baby steps towards achieving your goals. Keep an impressive wingspan even when the cubicle shrink. Save a dinosaur, ride an e-bike, don't get flat tires. Definitely have a flat tire. And we'll see you in the next vlog. Peace. <laughs>